Welcome back to another video and today I'll be um, checking out the Lego Mandalorian ship called the Razor Crest. So it comes with the Mandalorian, not in Beskar armour. Um, ready to show There's a cool cape. And a nice Beskar helmet. It's just a little bit of torso design. Not that cool. On his legs, he's got some holders. I'm guessing a gun holder. And. Mandalorian. This is a snow trooper. He came with a. Um, little pistol but I cannot find the pistol so yeah the design inside because you kind of get the black inside like with the white that looks pretty cool then he doesn't actually have a like black head so if you want to take his helmet off like yeah then you could see his head and then this is the baby Yoda how to say his name but yeah and cool he's basically a yoda but miniature miniature and um you can't you can't really move anything but his head because he's basically all one piece and the mandalorian can hold him like this on his hand the nurse and protect droid I may not remember all of their names I haven't seen the Mandalorian in a while and yeah this is a nurse and protect droid um, he has two weapons, one on his back and one in his hand. And he's basically a normal assassin droid. Normal droid body, but with a little clip on his back. Then one of these triangular ones and then just a normal cylinder brick with printing on it then next we come to this guy he's pretty cool got some uh, printing on his torso his legs are pretty plain but he's only got like printing on his torso and his face which are pretty cool so he can double shoot at the same time they're normal pistols his head he has another face out of this let's show this ship so i might quickly just pull this out so you can get a little bit of better look so inside here we've got two carbonites. If you turn to the back, there's no one actually stuck in them. They're just pictures, like they're stickers, and it's basically made out of these blocks, and then just one of these little plates, and that goes on top of it. If you can, um, you'll have to turn this around, so I'll stick this back on, and then we can turn the ship around. If you can, see, um, this is the Mandalorian's bedroom, but then here, you just
sliding both of them like that. On the outside, we've got some guns that are kind of heading in this direction in case he's shooting in front of him. And yeah. It's got some uh, details on like here so it sees kind of like dirty or like rusty. And then if you come to the front of this, you see this. Um, so the cockpit's pretty cool. But it, I still, I'm, I'm still having trouble trying to, you know, get this off. I'm guessing you just yank it off. There's a spot for two people, but in the Mandalorian show, you, there's actually a spot for three people. And uh, yeah, got your little control panel here. It's got a bunch of buttons on it. And stick that back on there then on the top up here got like a little escape pod put it back on it only connects but by like two lego studs so yeah it's pretty easy got a little hole in the top then it just slides in there you can take it out like that or like that pretty easy towards the back of the ship nothing that cool to see it's just this opens up and you know you could walk out of here and then yeah so it does open up I think it's meant to because like that's kind of just lame. Mm -hmm. oh, sorry. Engines because they're really detailed and it was really fun to build them. Take these off but they're not that good. So yeah, if you get this Lego set, it will take you about a couple like, days to build because it kind of took me uh, six hours to build this. And yeah, it was long. I had to actually kind of rebuild it because I kind of messed it up. You don't want to mess this Lego set up because it will take you longer to build it. Because I actually kind of built it, but then I had Lego bricks that were um, spares and they weren't supposed to be spares, so yeah. And the engines just slide in there. I really like this printing, it kind of goes, wraps around to the middle here. And then here has a barrel with a couple of bricks in it. Then this, which shows that the engines are on, and it just clicks in the bottom of that. That just connects onto that. And then here, I'm not really sure what this is supposed to be. I'm guessing it's just for like a little bit of detail. But yeah, and then this side, it kind of stores a couple. Um, of these little things yeah just connect them here it's kind of tricky to do
guys and also do it. There we go. It just clicks in like that. Has another gun on this side. Now the guns do actually come off, they just connect here. There are a bunch of just plates and bricks. Droid body, so like a astromech droid. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Just uh, goes there. And if you press down here, it shoots. After going to burn that sort of. That came with extra bullets just in case you do, um, can't find your butt because like if you shoot it and, and you don't know where it went that's kind of a problem because like now, now I can't find this butt. I'm probably going to sleep with it tonight and then just notice or I might find it later but yeah. So these characters, um, so this guy, he could probably be like trapped in here, so spot, or somewhere like that. The Mandalorian, take his gun off, clip it onto there. Be a pilot. So you can just, uh, Snapping in there. Baby Yoda in the next seat, but it will probably be pretty hard to get Baby Yoda back there. So yeah, I don't really recommend Baby Yoda going in there. I, re I recommend him going in the middle of it. So we've got the Mandalorian in there. Not let's, let's put them here. I ship around because like there's not really that much room. And also I need to, to take the engine off. Shadows, I've kind of got my phone light on. So I'm not actually using a proper camera, I'm actually just using my phone. So that's why it may not be that good. Supposed to fit the droid in, so I'm guessing you can just like squish them down. His head has been recovered. Squish him back there. Close it up. No one will notice. Oh yeah, and also when it's when you want it to kind of be night time, you can grab this sir. Uh, and also the baby Yoda. I'm gonna replace the engine right now. Oh, that's upside down. sleeping with the Mandalorian because they're four Lego bricks high so you know like you could have Mando sleeping there 
and you could have a little, little baby ear dust. Kind of truck it in and uh, grab his gun. You can just uh, have it there or let me know. Or you could probably put it in here. Store it like a bullet. And alone to be holding it. So yeah. I did something pretty um, like funny. I thought it was funny. It was like how the Mandalorian sleeps. You no, go sleep over there. Okay, I'm going to bed. Oh. Oh, he actually sleeps, I'm pretty sure. With baby Yoda on him. Or in his little space pod thing that didn't actually come with this set because they haven't made one yet like they haven't made a lego one yet so yeah the, the razor crest Or something, I was trying to get the baby Yoda onto the Mandalorian. Okay, come out, you there, and uh, just there. Then you can just pop them on the roof like this. Close these up so that like no flies or anything gets in, and then. Here as well. 